Hey guys, it's Kyle Bennett with HardwayCP.com and today what I've got is the new MSI uh, X399 SLI Plus motherboard out on the test bench and we're just getting ready to get it set up for testing and I thought since we've had a lot of people talk about these sockets being difficult to install into, I thought I would take us uh, basically a virgin look at what's going on here. This socket hadn't been touched and uh, so I thought we'd just see how... Uh, how the process went of getting this one installed and to see if we had any uh, difficulties so this is down on our uh, down on our solid surface much like it would be mounted into a uh, a motherboard case so there's three let's try to steady away here let's see that lighting sucks let me get this light down here so hopefully get a little bit better lighting a little bit better? Yeah, it's a little bit better. This uh, I did no prep for this, just total seat of the pants sort of deal. So there's three and two. Make sure that one's all the way out. All right, so our number one bolt there. All right. So I feel it let loose. I'm hold it down. And now this should spring up which it does, revealing our socket. So now we should be able to uh, grab the little blue tabs right there, pull up easily, that let go as it should. There we go, that's out. So now we're gonna, I'm gonna get that protective cover out of there. All right, so our Threadripper CPU is obviously in the carrier. We're gonna get it inserted back into the edge there and let it slide down in you can watch it and see it track right there it's a little it gets to that detent down at the bottom and that's in that was really really easy all right so now what we want to do is remove the cover god be careful pull straight up and get that out of the way now we're going to Pressure back on our two blue tabs easily, down to your click. She's down in there as she should be. At least it feels right to me. And we're going to come back, load up. Now this is where people say they have problems, so let's see. That one grabbed just that easy. Now I think where people have some problems here in the back, and honestly if it didn't, you can push down really hard on that, it's not going to hurt it. So I think this is where people have some problems and we're going to turn backwards and see if we can hear that thread click. So there's the thread. So this threads on this, this is a loat socket. So there's that one. There's the thread. So now all three of those are in the threads. Um, so maybe the initial issues that people saw on the other sockets, I know some Foxconn sockets, They've said some of them are different. I don't know. Anyway, I just wanted to film that and just see how it went. So apparently the load sockets are working really, really well now. Anyway, this is Kyle Bennett with Hardo CP.